and the roles he plays, Red Skelton actually lived the adventurous and dangerous life of a newsreel cameraman in the filming of his latest motion picture, Watch the Birdie. Red frequently turns up in strange places, but never in all his hilarious career has he found himself in a spot like this. There must be an easier way to make a living. And now we've got news for you. Take you behind the cameras for an on-the-spot report. The Red Skelton and beautiful Arlene Dahl go into the final scenes of the picture. <laughs> we do mean final. <laughs> With what's the birdie completed, Red enjoys a short vacation. Perhaps he'd like to take this opportunity to say a few words. Red? Red? Oh, hi, you folks. It was a great fight, but I won. I mean, it's a great picture if you like fun. Say, Red, how would you like to tell the folks about your new comedy, Watch the Birdie? I'm glad you brought up that subject. It just so happens that I have my movie projection machine with me. I'll run a few scenes for you. Just watch that screen over there. This is the first time they ever split an actor three ways. I mean it. That's me. All of them. Rusty. He's the cameraman. Pop. A problem child father. And Grandpa, nothing's a problem for him. This is Arlene Dahl. The day I kissed her, I wouldn't let the studio pay me. That's uh, very flattering, but uh, what I had in mind is a real estate project. And Ann Miller, that's pretty nice work, too. Oh, kiss me. Kiss me. These are the villains. Leon Ames, Richard Roper. Uh, they get paid for being bad. Me, I'm good for nothing. This is one of the big moments of the film. And this is a nice trick, if you can do it. Stop the film. Hey, it's backwards. That's enough of that. But I'll tell you something. This is the first time we didn't show you the best part of the picture. 